You know, Joe? Yes, honey? I saw Anthony up late last night. So? Well, he was watching some girly show, and the girls were skimpily dressed. What were you doing up so late? Uh, I had to get a drink of water. Anyway, it got me thinking. Did we ever have the S-E-X talk with the kids? I'm pretty sure we did. Now, kids, I want to talk to you about sex. When a man... <laughs> Look at the time! Yes, I had to talk with the kids. But, say I didn't. I mean, don't you think it's too late? No, not really. With TV, movies, friends, etc., I think it's too late. It's never too late, Joe. Well, I don't see any unwed grandchildren. So? So I think we're out of the woods, Jane. Do it for me, baby. Please, I'll make it worth your while. You'll make me homemade lasagna? No. Oh, oh, you evil, hot temptress. Thank you, babe. Two homemade lasagnas. What a man does for his old lady. Hey, I heard that. What's wrong, folks? Is someone dead? You two never hold hands or else someone has died. Perhaps it's Grandma. Good one, sis. <laughs> Kids, your father and I think it's time that you learn the facts of life. <sighs> Wasn't that a TV show in the 80s with fat chicks in it? And George Clooney! Your mother feels I should talk to you kids about... Yes? Let me finish. Yes? The birds and the bees. You stole my moment, babe. More like the birds, the bees, and a lump of cheese. Hey, you stole my moment too. 
Are you two actually serious? I am 19, a woman, please. Ever kiss a boy, sis? No, <laughs> but I know you have. Huh? So your father is going to tell you about this wonderful experience. All right, kids, upstairs. Well, kids, I'll make this simple for you. Why are we in Anne's room? To get away from your mother, of course. Now look, I know you're both adults, and I'm, I'm relatively comfortable with all this, but it's your mother, and she thinks I, we should explain this to you. Then why isn't she here? Good point, son. She's embarrassed about it. Sheesh. Now, sex, well, there's more to it than that. Uh, making love is when you are completely and utterly passionate about the person you love. They mean so much to you that you need to share your love physically. Mm. All loves aren't physical, but the special kind of love you share with a person like your soulmate. For example, your mother and I. Man... Just, just stop already. I'm gonna be sick. Uh, Dad, aren't you a little too old to be playing with dolls? Be quiet, son. Now, say this dinosaur is the man, and this doll is the girl. Why not use an action figure? This is the first thing I saw, and it's already in my hands. Okay. Okay. So, the dude and the girl, they go out for quite some time. I enjoy your time, miss. How about a date? Okay. Hello? Hello, Joey. Mom? Are you okay? Um, well, my house burnt down. What? How my did... house burnt down. How did that happen? Check it over with Joe and let you know. It's too late. Hey, baby. After spending a lot of time with you, I know I love you. You know what? What? I love you, too. We shouldn't go so fast. We should wait till we're married. Will you marry me? Okay.